Good morning, good morning, good morning, guys. Today's video is just going to be based off of my opinion, based off of my rant, based off my targeting experience. So, you know, today, if you don't have to grab no pens and papers. <laughs> but what I want to tell you is that this morning, you guys, since I posted that video yesterday, the target has been heavy. It's always going to be heavy once you're trying to empower those that are targeted or once you try to um, give somebody the knowledge that they don't want them to have. So, yes, the targeting has been heavy this morning. Every target that, excuse me, every person that I have seen to be a part of my targeting was out this morning just waiting at the school waiting behind me and what I do is I'll just pull over what can they tell you you have other parents at this location that's just here and their kids done walked into the campus about two hours ago so what can you tell me differently so I just pull over and wait it's gonna be a waiting game it's either you or me but anyways, that's what I just wanted to tell you guys that the targeting is heavy, but I don't care because it's time to eat. I lose no sleep because I, I wake up in the morning thinking about how much I'm going to eat and I'm going to be full. My belly is full because I feel like if you're coming for me, I ruffle your feathers enough to get your attention. When you don't come for me, that means I didn't do nothing right. That you won this battle of this target game that America has placed upon those that mouth will not be closed to the injustice that they are receiving. Because you spoke up for your rights. I 100% know that my target is because I spoke up for the, my rights in the injustice corporate world. I know that for a fact. I know that for a fact and I can prove it to anybody that got questions I got answers but um, a lot of times they watch your video in order to implement a plan to see what you was doing or to implement the you tell me so I can be in front of you plan I only tell so much I used to post all of my recordings in regards to the information I receive about the targeting meaning like I used to pr um, post my proof no, we just going to pull that out like a rabbit out of magic hat later on in this game. You know what I'm saying? Like sometimes you can't tell your right hand what your left hand is doing. So those that have proof, hold on to your proof because one day it's not going to go in vain. I believe this battle is due to the end of the world. I believe that one day we're going to be able to tell our stories and have a platform because I'm not giving up. I'm not shutting up yet. I'm not tired this let the games begin you guys place this upon me i'm not gonna go to sleep and cry at night and hold my pillow tight and hoping at this end i'm gonna let you guys know i she's not tired yet it's time to eat i'm still hungry i need food in my system and y'all the food and nourishment that i need to make sure that we succeed at justice but long not long story short okay when you are battling these demons I just hope that you guys know that in order to win this battle is not yours meaning you got to seek higher power you have to understand that we got to turn our powers over to the Lord yes I'm just ranting and raving okay and when it comes to your children did y'all watch the Phoenix program? Google it in regards to the same thing that we're dealing with. But it was on 10 times worse because they they were, I can't say they were, they probably still are, kidnapping kids in order to learn how to do these tactics that they're placing upon us today. They are conducting experiments on innocent children that come up missing. That's where they're taking them to these labs and saying like, what can I do to these kids? that I can do to these adults so I can have control over the world that's what they want they want to control us but you don't you don't you know like remember the saying used to go you don't you catch more flies with honey than you do with vinegar they can control us in the nice way all you gotta do is ask and say you know what let me explain to you why I need you guys to be in order because this 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 I'm pretty sure a lot of people will comply but doing it this way 
is causing mental harm where people is angry and they don't want to listen they don't want to listen so educate yourself in a form of matter that when somebody come against you you already have the answer you don't need to wait for them to give you the answer educate yourself when you're a target individual this is the educational background that you're going to need you don't need to pay for it it's too much information on google it's too much information in the library i want you to look at this man walking backwards because he's trying his best job to make sure i go to the thing but i'm saying now he turned around you see what i'm saying this is some crazy stuff you guys we live in a road of chaos but google information on the educational codes google your laws google your rights google 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 take a pen write it down isn't that crazy y'all the man i was walking backwards did y'all see that i hope i caught that on film now he walking straight and he pull out his phone and text they try to sensitize you by letting you know you're watching and i sensitize y'all right back and wave and say i know you're watching how much do you get paid? I'm I'm not playing with these people. You gonna take me to jail for asking people how much they get paid to follow people? Let the games begin, okay? Cause you gotta understand that this is just a random rave. I'm just rambling. I'm sorry. It's not making a lot of sense, but I had to vent to y'all today cause I had a hard morning, but I ain't tired yet. So that's why I'm just using this time to vent, okay? <laughs> but anyways, back to the educate yourself next keep some people in your life remove some people in your life you got to remember that this you're going to become low a, a loner when it because you're not gonna be able to trust a lot of people but it's okay because you know what these people in your life is like your wisdom tooth it's just a wisdom tooth yeah it's like wisdom teeth were you born with your wisdom teeth no were you born with these people no but guess what some people come into your life like your wisdom teeth and what disrupt what you already had going on cause corruption in your mouth these are your life is represented to you is a representative metaphor of your mouth and cause pain and it hurts so what do you do you go to your dentist office and have it removed you have your wisdom tooth removed and what it removes the pain it might hurt temporarily you might swell up or be angry that you had to go through it but guess what once it's removed you feel good so remove these wisdom tooth people out your life yeah we're gonna call these people wisdom tooth this this truck that always follow me hey girl good morning i'm back <laughs> that's how you do i don't they don't bother me anymore i know my stalkers now like y'all can't touch me i can't touch you let the games begin so anyways remove these wisdom tooth people out your life because you can live without your wisdom tooth you can still eat i removed a couple of wisdom teeth and i still chew and i'm still fat yes she eats good so refer to these people in your life that are wisdom tooth sometimes you don't have to remove all your wisdom tooth to survive that's what i'm trying to tell you like I have some people that was in my life that try to remove themselves by believing what was placed upon me i said no that's not true and if i gotta come to you every day and let you know that this is a lie i will let you know the truth will reveal yourself reveal itself and that's what happened the veil has been lifted on some of the people that were trying to go against me that was considered family members but now they like doing too much because i think they feel bad now they're like calling and asking you want something can we visit i say no i'm okay thank you mm, i still gonna feed you with a wooden spoon because you shouldn't have went down that road in the first place but i wasn't gonna give up until i gained control because me i have a problem where i feel like i gotta win i'm like i'm not about to lose this battle y'all not about to take my family willingly if i you take my family because i gave it to you i didn't give them to you so i'm gonna keep fighting this battle until i win my family back once i want them back that was enough i really didn't want them y'all can still do what y'all do i'm gonna do what i do and that's how it is but long story short remove these wisdom to people out your life because you didn't you wasn't born with your wisdom teeth and when they came in and destructed, you can go to the dentist, which is your God. The dentist is your God and tell your God, remove them, please. And God going to say, I'll remove them for you. Don't worry. Sit back and watch me work. And guess what? You still going to be able to eat after that. <laughs>